new electric pickup trucks to hit U.S. streets soon. In the United States, pickup trucks are more popular than ever. With electrification on the horizon, purchasing an EV is a wise investment, particularly for pickup trucks. Hello, and you're already watching Tech Charge, a reliable source to get the latest info on automobiles and the world around them. In today's video, we'll see new electric pickup trucks to hit U.S. streets soon. So, without wasting your precious time, let's get started. The 2024 Chevy Silverado EV was recently unveiled to the public, and it comes with some impressive features and options. The all-electric pickup has up to 664 horsepower and a range of 400 miles, not to mention innovative storage solutions such as the return of the Midgate. Both launch trims are expected to have a range of 400 miles on a single charge and offer DC fast charging of up to 350 kilowatts. This means you can regain 100 miles of range in just 10 minutes of charging, and the My Chevrolet app's Energy Assistant feature can help you find the most efficient route to a charger. That entry-level MSRP is slightly lower than the starting price of the cheapest Ford F-150 Lightning, which is $39,974. The Blue Oval's most expensive trim starts at $90,000, which is less than Chevy. This 2024 GMC Sierra EV is capable of handling DC fast-charging power of up to 350 kilowatts. The mid-gate is a removable partition between the cabin and the bed that helps to lengthen the bed. This is advantageous because the Sierra EV standard bed length is 5 feet 11 inches, and the Sierra EV is unlikely to be offered with the smaller cab longer bed combination found in other full-size trucks. While the Sierra EV has intriguing features and capabilities, it is yet another full-size electric pickup with a starting price of more than $100,000. The Alpha Wolf appears to be small but powerful. It's a little smaller than the Ford Maverick, so it has some serious competition. It measures less than 6 feet and 1.83 meters in length. It will have a range of approximately 250 to 275 miles. This is impressive for a small electric vehicle, but we'd like to see it go at least 300 miles. The lithium-ion battery pack's capacity has not been specified. The AWD model can reach 60 miles per hour in 6.2 seconds and tow up to 3,000 pounds. Wolf will offer impressive interior features such as a digital center display beginning with RWD trim for around $36,000. The AWD model costs around $46,000. The XT pickup will have best-in-class towing of 17,000 pounds with a hitch and a maximum towing rating of 35,000 pounds with a fifth wheel and gooseneck. The XT will be available in a variety of configurations including service body upfits, two-door or four-door cabs, 6.5-foot and 8-foot beds with dualies, and towing capacities of 10,000, 14,000, and 17,000 pounds. XT owners will be able to select the 300, 400, or 500-mile battery pack with capacities ranging from 125 kilowatt hours to 250 kilowatt hours. The truck manufacturer claims that its batteries can be fully charged in 15 minutes using a 1.5 megawatt charging station. Atlas has not set an official release date, but production will begin later in 2022. The Canoe pickup truck brings back the vintage forward van feel with its extravagant looks. The front seats are positioned safely behind the front axle, but their designs sell the forward control concept hard, with a bit of front overhang and a windshield that touches down way out at the vertical face of the nose. Despite its appearance, the Canoe pickup is well on its way to the electric truck market. The Canoe pickup, which resembles a forward control pickup from the 1960s, uses its shape to maximize cabin space, functionality, and cargo hauling utility. The Canoe pickup, developed by a California-based startup company founded in 2017, will join an electric passenger van and cargo vehicles in the brand's lineup. It's expected to arrive in 2023 if everything falls into place for the company. The 2023 Lordstown Endurance comes from a new Ohio automaker. It will come with a combined 440 horsepower from its futuristic hub motor system. This four-wheel drive setup features an electric motor mounted directly in each of the truck's wheels, which reduces the number of moving parts and improves reliability and is less expensive to maintain. It is only intended for fleet buyers whose trucks need to make a living by working. The 75 mile per hour speed limit makes navigating the frantic, aggressive freeway traffic in the Detroit area difficult. The Endurance has a four-door crew cab body that provides passenger space that's competitive with other similarly sized pickups. The charge port is located in the middle of the Endurance pickup's body-colored shield, which covers the grille's usual location behind the Lordstown emblem. 
This beast with almost 10 cubic feet of storage is available and costs $65,000. The Ram 1500's front and rear electric motors will provide all-wheel drive. To deliver the claimed 500 miles of range, battery packs might be as large as 200 kilowatt hours, and the 800 volt system will speed up quick charging. Ram is aiming for a striking, sleek, and contemporary appearance to set the EV apart from the standard truck lineup. It has a distinctive front end with twin bar daytime running lights, a contrasting hourglass pattern, and an illuminated Ram emblem. The manufacturer claims that its class-leading towing, payload, range, and charge time will make up for its tardiness. With a price tag of $45,000 for the lowest trims, we anticipate a top-notch cabin with smart features, large screens, and numerous high-quality materials because it is a Ram. The 2024 Toyota Tacoma electric truck looks similar to the gas-powered model, but several visual changes set it apart. The new platform, which is shared with the 2022 Tundra as well as the new Lexus LX, enables a bewildering variety of powertrain options, body styles, and suspension options. We anticipate Toyota to offer a detuned version of the Tundra's hybridized twin-turbo V6, as well as a version of the 2.4-liter turbocharged i4 from the Lexus NX350 as the base engine for the Tacoma. Six-speed manual and 10-speed automatic transmissions will most likely be available, and both rear and four-wheel drive will be an option. This EV is expected to be priced at $50,000. Toyota's yet to release specific details of this model. So that was it for today. Hope you enjoyed watching the video. Like and share if you did, and comment down below to motivate us to make more of these videos. Subscribe to Tech Charge for the latest videos on automobiles. We will be back with more crazy videos soon. Till then, keep riding.